Good morning, everyone. I hope you like my new sweaty look. Because I didn't actually do a day one, but I'm on day two of no spend and 75 soft. You don't have to start the beginning of the month. You don't have to start the beginning of the year. But let me see yesterday. It was pretty good. I'll tell you a little bit about today. As you can see, I do have two apps. I have more than two apps, but there's three on that page. And one is just to track my habits, because it is a habit. And my hair has gone wild. I need a shower after this walk. Today I did a 45 minute walk. And yes, it was a 45 minute. I just tracked it as 30, because just did. And with the no spend, I wasn't allowed to actually put a zero. So I added five cents. So every time I put five cents in the habit tracker, it means that I haven't spent. So what am I not spending on? Now that is the question. Groceries, I'm allowed. Food, I'm allowed. No takeouts, no deliveries. Well, I'm the only store that delivers and I'm closed. And I'm also going to be tracking my fuel. Fuel is allowed. But I'm going to try to lower my kilometers per week or per month. And there's a few more things, and I can't remember them all by heart. Okay, so we're in the kitchen. Got my little book. And find my rules. Okay, up to now for no spend, the no-nos are no spending on smokes. I didn't buy smokes yesterday. It's been a long time I haven't done this, so I can just keep it up. And a vape and I have a lot of juices so probably when I'm finished with a vape juice I can just quit Hopefully, no clothes easy for me at least the easiest part no makeup I already have some so well I was reading the other people's rules and there's like no buying games video games and stuff like that that's so easy I never do Furniture and home decor. My furniture might be wrecked, but I'm not going to buy new ones. Restaurant takeout. So for me, it's going to be mostly don't go buy cigarettes. No clothes. And makeup. But as you saw, last week I did get hairspray mousse. Pantyhose. And the shoes. Uh, the gel polish, so I'll be using it the whole year. And the pantyhose were saved, yes. So what I'm actually allowing myself to spend on. Groceries, no kidding, I have to eat. Car fuel, well I'm going to try to lower my consumption. I have to pay my loans, my debt. If I need a doctor, of course I'm going to go to the doctor and get medication. I'm going to need cleaning supplies because I have them separately from groceries. I'm going to need shampoo, conditioner. If I need, I'll buy. And if I should visit my son in this year, because I know spent is usually a year, and I started backwards. I didn't start from the January 1st. I started... Yeah, yesterday. So that'll make the 12th of October. So it's if I should visit my son, only then, and be in an extra strict budget with eating out. Because I do want to have a Big Mac, a donut, or an iced coffee. So I'm going to let myself then only shop and do the extra kilometers. But on a budget always. Now with the 75 hard, it's easy. It's read 10 pages. So last night I started reading. And I read a lot. I just read 5, but I read more than 5. I was on page number 14. Duh. Drink a gallon of water. That one for me is impossible, so it's going to be drink a liter of water. 
Because if you put my coffees down, my soups or whatever else, like if there's too many liquids. So if I should drink three and a half liters of water plus coffees plus everything else, I'm just gonna be in the bathroom vomiting most of the time. Exercise six days a week, 30 or 45 minutes. It doesn't actually say you have to do it. Like go to the gym, walking is an exercise. Eat healthy. This is what I made last night just to cook today. Bread. And husband is cooking um, some spaghetti with um, prawns. It's a seafood. I don't remember what they're called. Gari this. So that's healthy. And last night, because I did want to cook a lot. I don't know. I made muffins. Burnt them a little at the bottom, but they're chocolate chip homemade muffins. So yeah, I think this two challenges, if I just skip the gallon, I don't want to end up being sick and going to the hospital because of that. It's going to be really easy for me. So doing two challenges at the same time. Now that's a challenge for me. And I'm also trying to find ingredients, cheap ingredients. And this smells good. So I think I'm on the right track. And today I weigh 51.4. Am I doing this to lose weight? No. I'm just trying to challenge myself because I'm getting bored. So till tomorrow, I'll let you guys see a few pictures of a few things that I saw on the way that kind of caught my eye. Not too much, but just a few. So what do you think of my challenge till now? Should I add or abstract things? So till tomorrow, see ya guys. Thank you.